to reach a compromise on this stalemate. Jeff Kirui will be giving us the latest on that and so much more. But first, our top stories. Now, members of parliament and the pastoralist parliamentary group have called on senators to safeguard devolution as they try to unlock the standoff on revenue sharing formula. The MPs say they will not support any formula that will have any county lose money from what they were getting in previous years. Let's take a look. Uh, PPG, we want to say thank you to all the senators who are for equity and who are for Kenya. And I'm sure they will be able to get the support of all the senators and speak in one voice. So our main concern is to ensure that we don't leave any county or any part of this country behind. We are all in Kenya and we are part and parcel of this great country. So let us not try to impute uh, uh, issues which really uh, does not concern the real Kenyans. We have been taken down history lane about the famous uh, bombers draft, uh, and which was very good actually. And we are also aware in bombers draft, Mount Kenya delegates walked away from, from that bombers draft simply because it was talking about things to do with devolution. So they, have, they, have, they haven't started this issue of not being keen on devolution now. It started during Bomber's draft uh, uh, case. And so we tell them, we have never been keen because always the center has been supporting the center. So we want to ask that Kenya is composed of both land and population. 80% of this land is not in the center. So you cannot also have only 20% of resources, national resources, going to only to the center. And the only when we ask for a bit of devolution going to the periphery, then you're still trying to make noise. They want to increase revenue to counties by 35%. And I'm told they want to do this through the BBI. What is stopping them today? There is no law. Actually, the law says minimum of 15%. Let us allocate counties 35% and do a supplementary budget today because there is no law that is stopping us. Why do you want to camouflage and say after BBI the resources will be raised to 35%? What is stopping them today? Let them tell us it is this article of the Constitution, it is in this act that we need to amend to raise that revenue to 35%. We are not children. When we were making this constitution, and the spirit of the constitution was to devolve resources. And one of the principles of the devolution was every, five, every year we need to devolve more services. Not to remove services from counties, from the developed counties. This national government is failing in devolving more services to county and allocating more resources to county. And instead of doing that in a progressive way, now they're even reducing 